Mother Nature seems to be a little bit confused for November, but no complaints here. What a gorgeous day. A beautiful day today. Very warm for very. the start of November. Mm -hmm. You know, very close to our record breaking temperatures. Not quite record breaking, but still mid and upper 70s for today. All I'm seeing is that continuing trend we've had all through October, up and down, up and down, <laughs> overall staying above average for okay. temperatures, but up and down. We are going to get on a down slope from here. We're going to see some cooler Sorry, temperatures everyone. return. Yeah, I can't stay forever in <laughs> yeah. the 70s. Well, have a look at our temperatures now. 70s in the evening for November 1st, 75 right now in Lansing. The high was 77. The record for reference is 79. We haven't quite gotten up to that. We'll slowly cool down into the rest of our evening, but look at the whole region. It's all above average, near 80 in parts like northern Ohio and all the way through Illinois and Indiana. This nice warm air mass is overhead. Even 70 as far north as Alpena. It's only cooler near the lakes. Meanwhile, zooming out, the sunshine has helped us out today. That's also what helped you know, push up our temperatures. But looking west, more clouds, a little bit of a disorganized spot of rain towards the central plains. It's all heading this way. We'll see a cloudy, rainy Wednesday, which is at the top of your weather headlines. Rainy Wednesday, dry weather after that. We have many dry days ahead in our seven day and less warm. Not cold by any means. We're still going to stay seasonable to above average in most of your extended forecast. But for the rainy Wednesday, Starting after lunchtime and lasting pretty much all afternoon, all evening, and most of the night long. Some thunder might even be in the mix since we're going to see temperatures well into the 60s tomorrow. But for tonight, still a mostly clear evening, increasing cloud cover after midnight, and then through Wednesday morning, a cloudy or mostly cloudy start. But no rain likely for your morning commute. It's probably well into uh, 1, 2 p.m. and later as we start to see showers move in from the west. So end of your school day, end of your work day, you're probably going to see some of those showers, at least on the radar, if not overhead. But then as this low pressure center starts to work its way right over mid Michigan, Wednesday evening is probably when we'll see our heaviest and steadiest rains, and it'll just continue all through Wednesday night, probably hearing an occasional rumble of thunder. At least it's possible. Might not hear that, but given how warm it is, low pressure right overhead, it's possible. You don't hear that too often on November 2nd. Thursday's forecast, maybe some early lingering rain, but it'll start to clear up from there by Thursday afternoon. We see sunshine and sunshine and dry weather dominates all the way through Friday and all the way through the weekend. Cooler temperatures a bit mid 60s tomorrow still very pleasant, but 50s return and then uh, some mid and upper 50s still a bit above average all the way through your trend. 55 though your low tonight, very mild increasing cloud cover tomorrow's high about 66 for Wednesday. Rainy cloudy day starting in the afternoon. Wednesday night only down to 50 with more rain there in the Thursday Friday time frame 50s return. Uh, something a bit more seasonable and then even the weekend looking like we could push over 60 again. After a very soggy rainy Wednesday, we have a long stretch of dry weather ahead of us. It's looking great this weekend for the first weekend of November. Go out and enjoy it while we have it. Yeah, sounds like a great.